hadn't absorbed the shock. He Just a minute. The weather was perfectly clear tonight, and you're telling me that was struck by lightning? There was no lie in Pippin's eyes. A fool. But an honest fool, he remains. He told Sauron nothing of Frodo and the ring. We've been strangely fortunate. Pippin saw in the Palantir a glimpse of the enemy's plan. Sauron moves to strike the city of Minas Tirith. His defeat at Helm's Deep showed our enemy one thing. He knows the heir of Elendil has come forth. Men are not as weak as he supposed. There is courage still, strength enough perhaps to challenge him. Sauron fears this. He will not risk the peoples of Middle-earth uniting under one banner. He will raise Minas Tirith to the ground before he sees a king return to the throne of men. If the beacons of Gondor are lit, Rohan must be ready for war. Enough! Tell me, why should we ride to the aid of those who did not come to ours? What do we owe Gondor? I will go. No. They must be warned. They will be. Follow the river. Look to the black ships. Understand this. Things are now in motion that cannot be undone. I ride for Minas Tirith. Won't be going alone. Of all the inquisitive hobbits Peregrine took, you are the worst. Hurry, hurry! <laughs> 